don't mind the lighting, don't mind anything, but also the hair clip and the cup. That's all. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel today. The lighting, I know. We are working on getting my Hello Kitty mirror in here. It's still in my son's room, but for now we have the long mirror. Today we are starting the decluttering series. Even though I already kind of started it off camera, this is gonna be the start of it. And I figure what better way to start off by my makeup and everything. I know I've done decluttering in the past, but now, <laughs> If you listen to my podcast, well actually, that episode will be out soon. My mindset has just changed so much since having a baby and I just really, now more than ever in my life, just need to like get rid of everything. I need to just, I need to get rid of the stuff that's just sitting and I'm not using. That being said, I have already started to go through some of my stuff, obviously, as I've mentioned before. I've already kind of went through my three drawers right here already for my nail drawer, which I will get into because I want to move my fake nails out of, actually, that would be nice. Move all my fake nails into here with the other fake nails. That would make sense instead of it being in my closet. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But yeah, this is the next set I'm going to put on that I wore a few years ago. I have a lot of things that have just been sitting here, have not used, so, and probably expired. Let's get into this. New mommy edition. I think it's only fair that we go through my everyday makeup bag, which is in my Louis bag. I have a million beauty blenders, like you guys. I have not cleaned my beauty blenders in months since before I had Brian. Container that I keep them all in. They're all dirty. They all need a wash and they're mostly these mattifying ones that I am in love with and obsessed with. I might have to part with some that I don't use. Elf glow stick, limited edition. I use this all the time, all the time. She's almost done. I think I'm also gonna make a pile of things we're getting rid of, things we're keeping. Make it simple, not even an I don't know pile. Well, maybe an I don't know pile. So if I look a little haggard, I just came back from apple picking with my family and that was an adventure. With a baby, it was an adventure, but it was very fun and I'm very happy about it. It's got to be glued. Call me Queen Mascara. You guys probably saw these in my favorites already. Self Jelly Pop, keeping her. I haven't used her in a minute too. Rare Beauty bronzing stick. This is almost done. So I'm just trying to use this tiny little bit up until it's gone. I just started using this Wet n Wild Incognito Concealer, although I've had it for a very long time and it kind of stinks. So we may not be using this for long. It's in the color Light Honey because my Too Faced one actually, I'm assuming since I let it sit for so long, it stinks now. It absolutely stinks. It smells like fish and I'm like, excuse me, like we do not have a fish market in this house. So why? So that had to go. Everyone asks me all the time what this is. This is the Tula Cooling and Brightening Eye Balm. This is the Rose Glow and get it. I know it's like $35, but it is so worth it. Mine's a little weird warped or my under eyes, but this brightens my under eyes so much and it's just such a nice cooling effect in the morning that like, oh my God. Like I cannot get enough. I will always buy this. I will always, always, always buy this. As a mother, before I was a mother, like this saved me. Q-tip, that's dirty. One size spray. I like her. I mean, I Tower 28 will never be without this as well. We have my Kylie blushes, which you've seen in my favorites video. Love these. Just switched to this <laughs> lash curler, my Tarte one. Mostly for the summer, but I'll probably still use this. This is when I have no makeup makeup, the e.l.f. Dewy Dew Stick, which I do like as well. I just, you know, doesn't get as much love as it probably should. I have my two powders. These are more so for like the summertime, not summertime, the winter time. My Fit Me powders in Light Fair and Light. I like to mix these because one is dark and one's light. You get it. Like it just, it makes the perfect combo for me. So these can go out onto my little turny thing here. And then I'm currently using the Tower 28 powder. Oh my God. If you see my favorites, then you already know. I love this freaking powder. Like it's what I'm wearing today. And it's like snatched, flawless. Sharpener, of course. The e.l.f. Woe Glow sunscreen and primer. So I've been using this lately. I've just haven't been using the Jelly Pop. So we need to get back into that. Two eyeliners. I don't even think I've used these. Oh God, no, I haven't used this. So, <laughs> cause I wanted to start putting black liner in my waterline again clearly we have not done that so i don't know pile all right so we'll put everything back in here so the next area we are going to be going into is my jar of liners and glosses and i've gone through this so many times there's just some i have not used at all in like a year maybe more Too faced kiss and jelly gloss i love this i love it so much and not even just because it's called sour watermelon it's so nice i really like this i love the applicator she's not sticky she's like a lip oil gloss in one i think yeah oil gloss hybrid oh hell yeah my tower 28 gloss there's no doubt about it i love that gloss this elf sun boss gloss 
in the shade Pink Me Girl. Yes, I'm keeping her. This is a new Kylie lip liner I just bought in Comes Naturally. We're keeping her. Victoria's Secret Juicy Melon Flavored Lip Gloss. We're going to keep her too. Kylie, I've really just been getting back into Kylie. So she just put out some new matte lip stuff. And as a mom, she gets it. I, I get it now too, but obviously like she gets it. So I need to get those immediate full kiss lip glaze. I love these. So we're keeping her. Maybelline Gloss in Moon. I have not used this. So this is going. My Hello Kitty Lip Smackers. She's definitely expired. So I have to let her go. I don't, I don't want to. Look how cute she is. I could just buy another one. But in my head, I'm like, oh. oh my god, do you see that? It's like separated. Yeah, no. My DLA gloss in Search and Rescue. Check out DLA Cosmetics. I love her. Maybelline gloss in Sun. I have the one in Moon, which is supposed to be a dupe for the fussy, and I have not used it. So she's going. I'm gonna keep her because I like her. All of my Clean Fresh Yummy glosses from CoverGirl. I love these. I haven't used them in a very, very long time. No, they don't. I think we're gonna part ways, and then if we want them again, we'll buy them again. Makes sense. Makes sense. They've been sitting in the collection for a long time. Kylie Gloss Strip, underestimated. This is the stickiest gloss I've ever used in my entire life. I highly recommend if you want a really sticky, thick gloss. Oh my God. This Tarte Lip Plump Maracuja Primrose that everyone was like, oh my God, it's okay. Honestly, not that big of a fan. So I think I'm gonna let her go because I'm just not a fan. And this is probably expired because I bought this over a year ago. But even though I'm trying to declutter my life, it still sometimes gets the better of me. Elf Pout Pout Lip Plumping Pen. I think I used it once. So we need to use her again to make sure that we like her. As for all of my lip liners. Oh man. Highly we're keeping her. This is a Tower 28 work of art. I'm keeping MAC Whorl. I want this for darker lips. So I keep that. This is the Mario one in Hue. And I also have the matching lipstick in Sam. Hi, so we're keeping him. Candy K, yes. This is the Stassi and Kylie collection, which I love this color too. Keeping. I feel like it's okay for me to keep the, the lip liners to a lot of the lipsticks I've gotten rid of because they last longer. This is the About Face Fix Lip Pencil in Midnight Seduction. I feel like I've had this before, but I need to use her more. This is the e.l.f glide liner i don't know what shade it is unfortunately because there's no name on it oh wait the other they do this is in so tiny baddest beige dla one obviously i'm not getting rid of this this is in search and rescue as well the barbie color pop i've had this for so many years you guys the color is just so pretty so we're keeping that and then this is a color pop one that i also bought it's in the shade uh bff love her too so um yeah clearly i have a lip liner problem but i'm not getting rid of those so next we're going to go on to the tower we're going to start at the top up here bear with me now now, I also want to say that there's a ton of KKW discontinued fragrances on here. Those are not leaving. They are staying with me. I don't care. They're discontinued. I'm keeping them. But everything else is fair game. All these tiny little Ariana Grande perfumes. She came out with like a vault collection a couple years ago. And I obviously bought them because I never had Frankie. I never had this limited edition. I never had there was something else. I can't remember what it was. I bought the collection and now I'm like, why did I do that? Because I don't use these at all. If anything, I'll just keep the special ones that I don't have. But like I don't put them in my purse or anything. So I think I'm going to have to just part ways. So we're going to keep Frankie. It really smells pretty good because that's a special one and the Sweet Light Candy Limited Edition because that's special. Guys, look at the dust. This is why we're doing this. I do have Moonlight, which is a great fragrance. Love the original Ariana. Have that one too. Love. I have all these fragrances, except for Thank You Next because I recently got rid of that one. And everyone says it smells like pickles. <laughs> I can kind of see that now. I like the 2.0 better, to be honest. So that's gone. We have a little baby Rem. We have a little baby Sweet Light Candy. Love the little baby Cloud. Little baby. I have two of these. Little baby God is a woman. <laughs> They're so cute. Nail glue. I have a ton, ton, ton of nail glue. So I need to figure out a space for that as well. I have the, both the mod perfumes. I, fun fact, didn't really like these. And I actually got rid of them. I gave them away because I did not like them. Vanilla and I don't even know what this one was. Mod something. I don't know. A little mini Viva the Juicy perfume. Never used it. This is so sentimental to me. This one I found in a purse. This is the Bombshells in Bloom from Victoria's Secret. And it's a little spray. Just brings me back, but it also kind of stinks. So I might be throwing her out. And then these, you guys remember when I bought these little Nicki Minaj's? I love her original perfume, Pink Friday. But I again haven't used these. So we have Pink Friday. This one is I don't know the white one. And then I think this is Onika. I have this is a special edition. I don't know. So these are going to. Why do I do this to myself? I wish I could tell you. So I have a couple ducks up here from when I would get alcoholic beverages with ducks in them, and you can tell that there's mold inside them. So these are going to tack. 
I just had like piles here and now I don't. Okay, we have my Beatles top coat. We're keeping that. Sticker from Queen Cosmetics. I still love Queen Cosmetics. I just don't buy her that much anymore. Thing with this little car, this is never let your crown fall because it's true. Massive amount of nail glue because I get nail glue in every single little kit I use and sometimes they're glued shut, sometimes they're not. So I need variety, I need options. Glamnetic. These are all pretty much good glues. I think they're all like unopened for the most part. Ooh, like the Pink Friday one. Glamatic Hello Kitty. That one might not be good anymore. Swan Perfect and then Kiss. The pink glue is my absolute favorite. So we're just going to keep these ones. And especially since I don't want this where once my son gets bigger, he can grab it and open it and like ingest it. Like, no. So we're gonna have to figure something out for those. I'm gonna just put them right there for now. Next up here, I have this little bear that my husband gave me one year for Valentine's Day and he's all dusty. Oh, I have a memory card up here <sighs> for my camera that I don't use anymore. It's just hard to get the footage off the memory card onto my new computer. That's why I use my phone for everything now. All of my KKW fragrances. I should just put the fragrances up here. That would make sense. The heart emoji. We have this one I got on clearance at TJ Maxx. It is the opal one, I think. Yeah, opal mood. It smells so good. I will be sneezing after this. Kylie's nude one, which I wish she would have just came out with this on her own. Like, I love Cosmic, but come on, girl. Like, hello. Chloe's, because Chloe's my favorite Kardashian. We have her pink diamond and her sapphire. Just need to use these, honestly. Like, what am I doing with my life? The cherry. Does anyone remember this one? Oh my god. I bought this because I was, I think I got it for Christmas. Oh, it smells so good. I just need to, like, use what I have. That's just really the tea. Like, we need to use what we have because this is getting ridiculous, honestly. Okay, and then I do have some perfumes down here as well. <laughs> you have this little Hello Kitty one that smells okay, and I got it literally because it said Hello Kitty from Zara, because I'm psycho. I love Hello Kitty, so I can justify keeping her. And then I have my Vera Wang Princess perfume. This is a very controversial one. We have the Gabby DiMartino Beautiful Mess perfume. I still love this perfume, even though you can tell it's it's seen better days. Let's do the makeup part. This has not been used. Powders, I'm gonna put over here. Oh my god, my Queen Cosmetics stuff. I can go, that's broken. This I've had since quarantine. Are we still keeping these? Like, I just don't, I cannot part with these eyeshadow palettes. They're just so pretty. Base Cowboy is definitely two years old. I'm keeping my Queen Cosmetics stuff forever because this is like limited edition stuff that she came out with and I'm keeping it. Asia Brew Palette, we're keeping her. Ulta Beauty Effused Lip Oil and Cranberry that's never been opened. I don't know how good this little sample stuff is. July. <laughs> Little Baby Tower 28 spray, we're keeping her. Um, I never got to use this, probably expired, but I've not used. Doesn't say how long this is good for. I also have all my like gel polish stuff, like my foundation bases and some matte top coats. I don't even like the matte top coats, so bye. Highlighters, which I did not know until someone pointed it out that Jeffree Star discontinued all his highlighters. What? Crazy. Pink Tot, keeping him forever. I did not know that. <laughs> This so rich highlight. This has probably been open for a year. Oh, wow, it hurt. Very pretty though. I got this Pixie and Hello Kitty highlighter, which she's pretty. I just, she's like two dimensional, whatever. By the way, if you hear noise, they're still doing work next door. Yes, even on the weekends. It's a fun time around here. I'm filming by the way. I have these two blushes. You've been sitting in my collection for a few years now and I don't use them anymore. My little Becca highlight. Oh, we're keeping her. There's no way I'm keeping her. These Kylie ones. I don't even remember when I bought these, but I don't use them. Yeah, I'm fine. I love her though. This one is a blush. Haven't used. I'm gonna have to say goodbye to this one. My son doesn't need sleep or anything. We have the Rare Beauty one, which I was like, oh my God, so pretty, but I haven't used it. 12 months. <laughs> bye bye. My MAC one, oh my God. I think I repurchased this or I was going to. I have to keep her too. <laughs> this is so bad. Keep some powder things in case I go back to powder. Everything I'm keeping is mostly highlighters, which is shocking for me. Intense and foundations. I just bought this Kylie one we're keeping. Obviously I'm keeping my Tula and my Tower 28. That's happening. These are all my foundations I usually wear during the school year and stuff like that. And um, we haven't touched them in a minute, unfortunately. Does it stink? Because if it stinks, it's going. 
Wow, that's not good. They Lauder double wear, love. And we have the Haas Labs. I love the Haas Labs, oh my God. I'm still gonna keep her. I love her. I think I'm probably keeping all of these. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. Um, Rem Beauty Foundation. I need to get another one, but I love this foundation so much. And then Kylie! 3W. See, like, this foundation's in 3W, but I got her skin tint in 2N. I don't know. Are we okay? basically like kind of done with this one so i am gonna toss it apparently we don't know how to rest on a weekend oh i gotta put this in the other area these are my tower 28 cream products i love so so incredibly much cream blush this is the af94 blush this is probably over a year old i'm just gonna sneakily throw it in there anyway because i love that blush and then i do have the new Sachu Sachu lip liners I'm gonna actually put with my regular lip liners so I remember to use them because I keep forgetting. <laughs> Another e.l.f. Jelly Pop highlighter because can you tell it's like my favorite? NYX Wonder Stick for when I'm done with my bronzer so I don't need any bronzers. I literally don't need anything. These I'm very sad about because I never used and I don't know if they're still good. This is Barbie Girl and Champagne Showers from DLA Cosmetics. They're shimmer body oils and i've been meaning to use them and i haven't I feel like i should just keep them anyway it'll give me more motivation to use them and i'll put this up there so i can like put it on my body if i ever go out which is rare <laughs> but if i ever do i have stuff so there is that i know this doesn't seem like much of a decluttering video but this is a lot for me so i'm very proud of myself right now oh i forgot i have another section my lip oils i have two elf ones and two dla ones up here i do have one in my purse two in my purse actually I have my mac lipstick oh angel velvet teddy and this one is honey love change it up change up the vibe i have two l'oreal lipsticks ballerina shoes and ferris nudes like the like oh it's such a good nude for me i love it this is the mario lipstick in sam which i'm gonna have to get rid of soon <laughs> because i haven't used it and i don't know something about this formula just doesn't do well on my lips anyway so i think i am just gonna say goodbye to it. this is the color pop lipstick in golden beach that matches that lip liner and we've had her for like four years we need to just bite the bullet she's from the barbie collection <laughs> goodbye these tinted butter bombs from kylie i love these as well we have one in kylie and love that for you another one i just don't know where it is on a new rem beauty lipstick bubbly haven't used it yet no i know i know what you're thinking mario lip balm lip serum plumping lip serum and bronze glow I'm trying to use her too i don't even know how old that is this is definitely probably old this one's in cheeky this lip vinyl yeah that has to go and then we have two elf lipsticks in no doubt and dirty talk which again is another like perfect nude for me i love that they're like magnetic i love it that kind of reminds me of golden beach a little bit so i don't feel that bad getting rid of it anymore but i love that elf is like more like luxurious now too like something about the small l'oreal lipsticks reminds me of my mom and she used to love it's called rum raisin or something and they discontinued it typical this was me decluttering my makeup i hope you guys enjoyed this video helped you in some way inspired you to declutter your stuff too it's always good to do every few months as long as you don't fill it back up like me and i'm trying to break the habit now again stresses me out but here we are you know what he is just color we're getting rid of her i love you guys so much hope you have an awesome day subscribe if you want to see more of me like this video if you enjoyed turn on bell post notifications you know when the I post a new video stay tuned for more decluttering because there's more coming there's a lot more coming i can't stand it it's making me crazy just like that next door okay i love you guys <laughs>